Entering his first season as a head coach, Andrew Axhorn couldn't be more excited for the start of the regular season with his West Shore Rebels. Just grateful to actually be given this chance to coach a junior level football team. I mean, that's why I jumped on it when I did. I mean, it was great. What Axhorn brings is a lot of emotion. And you know what, that's awesome for a football team. Because without emotion, then there's really nothing here. And Axhorn's emotion for football dates back to his high school days, where he also found another passion. 20 years ago, um, I did my first show, which was Macbeth. And uh, that was my first year of high school. So I guess in this year again, my first year as a head coach, and I'm doing Macbeth again. <laughs> so foul and fair day, I have not seen. Speak if you can. What are you? Oh, hail Macbeth. While coaching a football team and acting on stage don't have a lot in common, Axhorn believes there are plenty of lessons that can bridge the gap. I thank you for your pains. Do you not wish your children shall be kings when those that gave the tale accord to me? How football and acting ties in is just discipline, right? And it's maintaining that discipline and, um, and I obviously have a lot of it. <laughs> and patience, patience, oh, you must have patience. Red, red, red. Axhorn's sidelines have been discovered by some of his players who might need to pull out the Shakespeare to earn extra playing time. I, I guess so, yeah. I read Macbeth in like, I think, grade 11, so I gotta do it again. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe, I, no, I don't think so. <laughs> and if this rebel season was envisioned as a Shakespearean play, you know, this is going to be like Henry V, I think. It's going to be one of those uh, historical plays, I think, because no one actually uh, expects much from us. But you know what? I got a good team here. I may have found my Henry V, so uh, <laughs> the rest of the league better watch out. <laughs>